We're seeing if the food at the Grub Father's restaurant is a deal that we can't refuse. Let's eat. Hi everyone, I'm Jay. And I'm Sam. And you're watching the theme park movies. And while many of the theme parks are closed near us for the winter season, because we live in like New York in the tri-state area, we actually wanted to highlight some more local options, right, Sam? Yes. And lucky for us, the Grub Father is very well known on Instagram. Yeah. Opened a shop, the Grub Shop. Mm -hmm. Not too far from our house, yeah. a little less than a year ago. Yeah, in Huntington. So we actually have some videos on some other spots in Huntington. Uh, so, you know, you could check out some of the playlists that we have for some local Long Island eats. But this is going to be all about the Grub Shop. And what do they have there, Sam? Uh, I think that they're known for their chicken fingers, yes. their cheese steaks, yes. wraps, comfort the, food. Yeah, and the restaurant itself, it's like a quick service type of uh, environment, but the restaurant itself is decked out with all local art made from local artists, yeah. as well as a mural to Anthony Bourdain, <laughs> which is kind of like uh, the icon or the idol to the Grub Father. So I'm really I'm really excited to try the to try the food out there. Yeah, right? and it's also actually right near the Paramount Theater. Oh yes. Yeah, yeah. the Paramount is a huge it, music venue. It's just a really popping area. So. Yeah. All right, I'm excited. You excited? I am. All right, join us for our dinner at the Grub Shop. All right, they are blasting music in here. Oh, Sam actually has one of their signature items, which is the ribeye cheesesteak. Look at all this. It's their own cheese whiz. Sauce. It's oh. melting right off of it. I'm so good. And uh, we also have got, uh, we got three of their things, their most notable things, the chicken fingers, which apparently are very notable, very large, and you can see the seasoning on them as well as the grub fries and the uh, buffalo chicken egg rolls. We also got what, each one of their dips. They have a fry sauce, a ninja sauce, a cowboy barbecue sauce, a sweet and spicy honey mustard. So a lot of different things. We to forgot to get mac and cheese, but yes. I think we'll be okay. Yes, they are also known for their mac and cheese. So that's something that we missed. But I'm excited to try each of these out. Sam, you already tried the fries. What'd yeah, you think? so the fries are, it's a hybrid. It's a crinkle and a snake fry, right? Yes. It's, I famously am not a fan of crinkle, but I do <laughs> like steaks, so this might cut the difference. I think they're good. I think they're, they're different. We haven't tried any of those fry sauces yet. I like to season it. Fry alone, where would you put it? Seven. Seven? You, seven's good. I feel like seven's our average number that we give them. Seven is good. All right, Sam. This bread is like so soft and nice. Yeah, I hear that. I think that bread is made in house. Oh, see those onions? It's ribeye meat too, which is a much, I think. Quality meat. Yeah, it's a quality meat. I really like the cheese sauce. Four out of ten. I am not like a cheesesteak person, mm -hmm. but this is delicious. I want to give this a nine. Wow. I gotta try with some of this chicken out. Look that looks that. like real chicken. Yeah. The breading mm. looks really good. Oh, it's spicy. You gotta dip that. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely a nine. So Ooh, good. I'm excited. All right, Sam, you hyped this cheesesteak up for me. And you like our cheesesteak, guys. So I'm mm. wondering what you think. I'm normally not, but that meat is... The meat that they use is really good, and I really like their cheese cheese sauce and the bread is soft there's chives in it it's like tender that's like quality of beef nine. Oh, you agreed with, nine. with me yeah no oh, good all right sam is going to try out that buffalo chicken spring roll i'm oh, sorry egg roll it's an egg roll. i think so far everything's been really good i think this might be my favorite so far Wow. Are you going to go for the full 10 then? I'm not going to go 10, but this is really good. So 9? It doesn't feel greasy. Good filling. Good nine. filling, yeah. 9. 9. All right, Sam is trying the honey mustard. Whoa. 
awesome. That's good honey mustard. One out of ten. This is like chicken guy level for me. Yeah, no, I think it's actually, I think the body's better than chicken guy. Oh. I'm giving everything a nine. <laughs> I know that's ridiculous, but. I want to try out these buffalo chicken egg rolls. Sam, you already had one. So this is a nine for you. This is your favorite thing, right? Yeah. Everything is very good, but. Yeah, I don't really know what you're saying. Yeah, I. The chicken is really good. Mm. I'll give it a, an eight. I still really like it. You're wrong. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try each of the sauces out and see which my favorite is. This is the fry sauce. You did it? Seven. Barbecue. Eight. No. Seven. Ninja sauce. Nine. Honey mustard. Seven. Yeah, so. All right, Sam, what'd you think of the grub shop? That was awesome. It was, I think it was really <laughs> awesome quick service food, and I thought the cheesesteak tasted like very high quality. Yeah. I also. The bread, the cheese, the meat, every yeah. like component of it was perfect. That was definitely one of the top things for me. We definitely gotta try to come back and try the mac and cheese. I also really enjoyed the aesthetic of the restaurant. Yes, it's very small, <laughs> like it literally is like a shop. Yeah. But it has really amazing yeah. artwork. Yeah, they even have, the seats are like there's painted. There's a little paint on the seats. The bathroom has like graffiti. There's a mouth actually where the food is made. So it's like <laughs> this is where the food comes out of is the mouth. Well, I guess the food goes into the mouth. Uh, also, the big mural of Anthony Bourdain, yeah, really very cool. well done. Looks like an exact picture of him. The local artist did an awesome job in here. And I mean, you got to figure that a huge food influencer that opens a restaurant is yeah. going to have good food. Like, yeah. he knows good food, so obviously it well, yeah. shows. <laughs> also, I probably mixed up some of those dips. I, I think I may have uh, flipped the, um, that, what was it, the ninja sauce with the fry sauce. <laughs> the fry sauce, I think, was my I favorite. I they were all good. The, all the dips were very good. That honey mustard was actually very good as well. I'm going to probably bump that up. To an eight. We definitely recommend checking out this shop. We thought it was really good. And uh, the Grub Father's Instagram obviously is one of the most uh, famous and well regarded Instagrams in Long Island. Uh, and we, New York City. Yeah, and New York City. So the, if you're interested in food, you yeah, haven't seen that, that's a great Instagram, Instagram to check. We also have an Instagram ourselves, <laughs> the underscore theme park underscore foodies, if you want to check that out. Uh, I had a great night here. I thought the food was awesome. For me, the cheesecake cheese steak was the top. What about you? Uh, I think the egg rolls. Yeah. I really like the egg rolls. They didn't feel greasy. Yeah. And also, even though that was like comfort food, I don't feel disgusting. You know, yeah. You usually feel gross. Yeah. Like, it, I don't know. They're, they're cooking it well. Also, the fries. Like, I'm not usually a fan of crinkle cut fries. <laughs> but they're a hybrid, so maybe. Yeah. I feel it was more helped. steak than crinkle. But you know what? I really like my, I feel like my true vendetta is with chicken and peach crinkle cut fries. Okay. So. <laughs> but they do crinkle cut fries well. We definitely recommend them. If you enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe, like, and really help our channel grow. Push this video out there into the stratosphere of the YouTube algorithm. Helps other people find the video. Subscribing also helps our channel grow. Hit the bell, bell notification so that way you're notified every time that videos come out. Which is when, Sam? Every Monday and Thursday at 12 p.m. Thanks so much for watching. Don't count the days. Make the days count. We'll see you next time. That's all, folks. Yeah, if you guys hear like some music playing in the background while we're talking, it's because, uh, or while we were eating, it's because the music in there was very loud. We're hoping it doesn't get flagged. That's a little very good music playing. <coughs> yes, like, really it's a good playlist. Good tunes. And also, just this area that we're in is so awesome. There's so many great restaurants and bars and things to do right on this strip. Yeah. So come to Huntington, Long Island for a good time. <laughs>